what is the thing you are trying to communicate? You're never trying to communicate 15 things. So how do you distill that down? And then actually, how do you support that argument if you're trying to persuade someone of something? How do you support it effectively from your audience's perspective? Because oftentimes we get stuck in our own frame or mental model of how we see the problem. It's actually important to see it from your audience's standpoint and for professionals is we take a limited number of really powerful concepts, how to frame a problem, um, how to build um, a well-articulated research plan, um, and then also a simple kind of communication framework. And what we really do is work those problems. So there's a lot of space within the class to bring your problem in and work on these and get specific feedback. Um, I think that's particularly important because so much of learning is applied. Sitting in a room and listening to concepts um, is helpful to a point, but it's very important to actually put those ideas and theories into action. That's where I sort of balance the academic and the corporate experience. Um, in a corporate environment, you always have a place to put these things into action. We try to bring as much of that into the classroom as we can.